Hi everybody. Welcome to my show. Today we're going to look at Lucas Nelson and Promise of the Real. And they are a California country rock band beginning in 2008. Lucas Nelson, Tony Logurfo, Corey McCormick, Logan Metz, and Tato Melgar. Lucas's father is Willie Nelson. Since 2015, Lucas Nelson and POTR have been Neil Young's regular backing band. In 2009, the band opened for Willie Nelson and later for B.B. King. Besides recording with Neil Young, the band also began recording their own songs, and this resulted in their first eponymous album in 2010. They toured on their own and appeared at festivals including Farm Aid, and then in 2012, they would back John Fogarty on his Canadian tour. And then in 2015, the band was present for the recording and touring of Neil Young's album, The Monsanto Years, a protest of genetically modified food. A film was made of the recording process, and Neil Young is well known for his protest music and stances since the 60s and Buffalo Springfield. Think Southern Man, for instance. Lady Gaga got into all of this, and Nelson, that is Luke Nelson, wrote with her and collaborated on the soundtrack of A Star Is Born in 2018. I believe that's a remake with this time in the starring role. POTR appear in the movie as Gaga's backing band. But here is their discography. One, Promise of the Rear. Did I say Promise of the Rear? Oh my God. I'm sorry. I can say I can't read my own writing sometimes. Promise of the Real. I'm curious about the vague line today that separated rock from country. It, in a lot of ways, seems like we're talking about the same music. I mean, you got your rock bands down in Nashville. You got your country bands over in Jersey. It's all mixed up. Two, Wasted in 12. From country, what makes a country song country? How does folk fit into that? Do you have to have folk in order for it to be country? Is there such a thing as electric country? Yes, of course, I'm sure there is. Is there folk in that? No. Country metal. Metal folk. Three, something real in 16. <clears throat> Four, Lucas Nelson and Promise of the Real in 17. It went to number two on the U.S. country chart. And that's a pretty big deal. Five, Turn Off the News and Build a Garden. And that went in 2019. And it went to number 151 on the U.S. Billboard chart. Not the country chart. I don't know what it went to there, but that we have a country band on the Billboard chart. That's promising. And then, just out, Naked Garden. Looks like he took his own advice from the previous album, Turn Off the News and Build a Garden. Because here it is, Naked Garden. And I believe that's all I have on Lucas Nelson 
but I'm sure that he will be back in and around years to come. Our ears, our eyes, our thoughts. And thank you, Lucas, for doing this. You are definitely a chip off the old block.